to my channel and as you can tell by the title, this video is going to be a really, really exciting one. And obviously we are going to be getting a golden retriever puppy. And this is the day before we are going to go get him. And it's kind of a really cool story about how this all happened that we ended like that we're able to get him. So sit back, relax, get comfortable, and I'm going to kind of briefly tell you the story about how it all happened. So we were going to get the puppy um, from quite a ways away. Like it would have been we would have had to stay overnight somewhere and all that, like it's several hours away. And we were going to get a puppy from there earlier this spring, but because of the coronavirus and all that, it was like really close to the start of all these orders to like be stay-at-home orders. And so we weren't really comfortable with like traveling and you know, doing all of that and going that far, staying in a hotel. And so we postponed that and we were going to wait until um, I think it would be September that we would be able to get another puppy. But my mom was just looking at um, different things online on Facebook and uh, the place that we were going to get um, our first, like our original puppy from, got um, another puppy from this other place that is really close by to us. Well, like three hours away, but I mean, that's a lot closer. And so she just went on their Facebook page to like look at stuff and there actually ended up being a puppy um, available because their family uh, lives too far away and they also couldn't get theirs because of all the coronavirus restrictions. But because we live so close, um, we thought that we would give it a shot and message the person saying that uh, we could take the puppy if it was um, possible. And so my mom messaged um, the person and they saw the message but they didn't reply. And then we saw that there was an update on the post that oh, um, he got a home, stuff like that. So we thought, oh, we were too late, and we'll just have to wait until September. But then, apparently, later on my mom got a message from the, the person that said to uh, give them a call. And so she did, and it turns out that the people that were going to replace the original people that were going to get the puppy also couldn't get it for reasons we don't know. And so... And that made the puppy fall to us, and so now, I mean, we just found out about all of this on a whim yesterday, which was Friday, today's Saturday, and we're going to go pick him up on um, tomorrow, Sunday, I couldn't think of the day for a second. So, yeah, that's happening. And it's, it kind of all happens super quickly, but it's crazy how we, like, there was like, it fell through for two people, and it came to us, and so that just makes it feel more like, like those other things, like I feel bad for those people that didn't get to have him in the first place, but like, I feel like those two families not being able to get him, it's like, them falling through with all of it, like, and then him coming to us, it's kind of like it was meant to happen, you know? And, yeah, I mean, we knew that we were going to get a puppy, like, for several months, like, since last year we've known, but we just didn't know exactly, exactly when. So, I mean, we have all the stuff. We have a crate, we have food, we have treats, we have 
um, a playpen thing, you know, toys, um, a collar for him, all kinds of stuff. Anyways, we were originally going to name our puppy Copper if, like, I mean, if we got to choose the name, but this puppy's name is already Charlie, so it's still a C name, and I mean, it's not like it really mattered. So that's perfectly fine. Yeah, so we are going to go and get Charlie tomorrow, and don't worry, we are going to um, take the proper social distancing precautions and everything, and we don't feel like it's as, as much of a risk since we don't have to stay overnight in a hotel or like go really far. Like we can do this all in one day, and we can wear masks and you know do all that. So we will be safe. Don't worry. So yeah, thank you for watching and um, just keep I keep on watching the rest of the video to um, follow along journey of getting Charlie. Okay, hey, I'm back. I was going to um, do this in the last clip, but I forgot right after I like, stopped recording. I remembered. Um, I'm going to show the shirt that I'm probably going to wear tomorrow, which I actually got like months ago, knowing that we were going to get a puppy in the future. And I've been waiting like so long to wear it, and it combines Disney, which I really like, and yeah, so let's, um, okay, not that one, this one, alright, see, I still haven't had that large thing on it, okay, it says, I just wanna hang out, no, hang with my dog, not hang out, okay, and it has a Mickey and Pluto on it, and I thought that was really cute, and I'm super excited to finally be able to wear this and go get a puppy after waiting for so long. Super thankful for this. Just got him inside 
and we were playing outside in the backyard with him for a little while, but he's inside now, and he seems to like his little dinosaur toy. We named it Ralphie. He knows several commands, and he does them most of the time. And then he already ate some food, and playing with his toys, just exploring around. Well, okay, that's, don't know how much you want to, how much footage you want to see of this, but, but yeah, this may or may not be the end of the video, so just thank you for watching and stay tuned for more videos with him. <laughs>